Welcome to Holistic Wellness 24-7. In today's video, we're looking at foraging for food, 10 wild plants you can eat right now. Whether you're looking to cleanse, revitalize, or enhance your wellness, you've come to the right place. In this video, we'll take you step by step as we explore 10 delicious and nutritious wild plants that are safe to eat and can be found in your local area. Whether you're a seasoned forager or a curious beginner, this video is packed with valuable tips on identification, preparation and culinary uses of these wild edibles. You'll also learn how to recognize plants like dandelion greens, purslane and lamb's quarters and get ready to elevate your meals with fresh, organic flavors right from nature. Finally, we'll also cover important safety tips and ethical foraging practices to ensure sustainability. By the end, you'll have a clear, simple roadmap to improve your well-being step by step. My videos focus on the how-to of expanding your lifespan and more importantly, your health span, how you can now transform your life. So let's get started. Did you know that some of the most common weeds in your backyard are actually edible superfoods? Yes, those pesky plants you often pull out and discard could be a treasure trove of nutrition. Dandelions, for instance, are not just a nuisance. Their leaves, flowers and roots are all edible and packed with vitamins and minerals. Imagine turning your backyard into a free organic grocery store. Join me as I challenge myself to find and eat 10 wild plants you can forage right now. This journey will take us through forests, fields, and even urban areas, showing you that nature's bounty is all around us. Whether you're a seasoned forager or a complete beginner, there's something here for everyone. We'll learn how to identify these plants, understand their benefits, and incorporate them into delicious recipes. There's a growing interest in sustainable eating and reconnecting with nature, and foraging is at the heart of that. More and more people are turning to foraging as a way to reduce their carbon footprint, eat healthier and save money. It's a practice that not only nourishes our bodies but also our souls as we spend time outdoors and develop a deeper connection with the natural world. It's about understanding the landscape, recognizing edible plants and harvesting them responsibly. Foraging requires knowledge and respect for nature We'll discuss the importance of sustainable foraging practices, such as taking only what you need, leaving enough for wildlife and ensuring the plants can regenerate. This way we can enjoy nature's gifts without depleting them. Incorporating wild edibles into our diet isn't just good for the environment, it's good for us too. These plants are often more nutrient dense than their cultivated counterparts. For example, wild greens like nettles and chickweed are rich in vitamins A, C and K, as well as minerals like iron and calcium. By adding these to our meals, we can boost our health in a natural and sustainable way. These plants are packed with nutrients and offer unique flavors you won't find in any supermarket. Imagine the peppery taste of wild mustard greens, the tartness of wood sorrel, or the sweet burst of wild berries. Each plant brings its own distinct taste and texture, adding variety and excitement to our meals. So let's embark on this foraging adventure together and discover the hidden culinary gems that nature has to offer. Our first plant is one you're likely very familiar with, even if you don't realize it's edible. The humble dandelion, often considered a nuisance in gardens, is a nutritional powerhouse just waiting to be harvested. Dandelions are more than just a common weed, they are a treasure trove of nutrients. Every part of the dandelion is edible, from the roots to the blossoms. The leaves are rich in vitamins A, C and K, and they also provide a good amount of calcium, iron and potassium. The flowers can be used to make dandelion wine or added to salads for a splash of colour and a hint of sweetness. Even the roots can be dried and used as a coffee substitute or roasted for a unique flavor. In many cultures, dandelions have been used in traditional medicine. They are known for their diuretic properties and are often used to support liver health. So the next time you see a dandelion, don't just think of it as an unwanted weed. Consider it a versatile and valuable plant that can add both nutrition and flavor to your meals. Embrace the dandelion and discover the many ways it can benefit your health and well-being. Now we're going to search for a plant that announces the arrival of spring with its pungent aroma wild garlic, also known as ramps. 
Our next stop takes us beneath the surface as we unearth a hidden gem, the Chicory Root. Wild berries, nature's candy. Let's move on to something a bit sweeter. Summer brings an abundance of wild berries and we're going to seek out some of the most common and delicious varieties. Plantain, the backyard healer. We often overlook the unassuming plantain, mistaking it for just another blade of grass. But this plant has been used for centuries as a natural remedy. Stinging, nettle handling with care, cooking with flair. Now we're going to tackle a plant that requires a bit of caution but rewards us with incredible flavor and nutrition, the stinging nettle. Clover, more than just a lucky charm. You've likely strolled through fields dotted with clover, admiring their delicate blooms. But did you know that this common plant is also edible? Sorrel adding zest to your foraged feast. Let's add a tangy twist to our foraging adventure with sorrel, a lemony herb that thrives in meadows and along woodland edges. Wood sorrel, a taste of lemon from the forest floor. Our next plant is a delightful surprise you'll find hiding beneath the shade of trees, wood sorrel. Purslane, the omega-rich weed. We often find purslane popping up in our gardens, but instead of pulling it out, we should be adding it to our plates. Lamb's Quarters, the wild spinach substitute. Our final plant is a true testament to the abundance of nature's bounty, Lamb's Quarters, also known as wild spinach. We've explored 11 incredible wild plants today, proving that nature provides an abundance of edible treasures right at our doorstep. Each plant we've encountered has its own unique flavor, nutritional benefits, and culinary uses, making foraging not just a hobby, but a way to reconnect with the natural world around us. From the humble dandelion to the surprisingly delicious stinging nettle, these weeds can become nutritious and flavorful additions to our meals. Dandelions, often dismissed as mere garden nuisances, are packed with vitamins A, C and K and can be used in salads, teas and even as a coffee substitute. Stinging nettles, despite their prickly reputation, lose their sting when cooked and transform into a nutrient-dense green that can be used in soups, stews and even pesto. Imagine a vibrant wild green salad with dandelion greens, sorrel, wood sorrel and purslane topped with a sprinkle of clover blossoms. Each ingredient brings its own unique taste and texture to the table. Sorrel adds a tangy, lemony flavor, while wood sorrel offers a slightly sour, refreshing bite. Purslane, with its succulent leaves, provides a mild, slightly peppery taste, and clover blossoms add a touch of sweetness and a pop of color. Or a comforting nettle soup with wild garlic and lamb's quarters for a foraged feast. Wild garlic, with its mild, garlicky flavor, pairs perfectly with the earthy taste of nettles, while lamb's quarters, often called wild spinach, adds a rich spinach-like flavor and a boost of vitamins and minerals. This hearty soup not only warms the soul, but also nourishes the body with every spoonful. Ready to take your first step into the world of foraging, it's a journey that begins with curiosity and a willingness to explore. Start by familiarizing yourself with the common edible plants in your area. Invest in a good field guide or join a local foraging group to learn from experienced foragers. Remember, safety first. Always positively identify a plant before consuming it and be aware of any potential lookalikes that may be toxic. Don't let these hidden edible treasures stay unnoticed. The more you learn about the wild plants around you, the more you'll appreciate the diversity and abundance of nature's pantry. Foraging not only provides fresh, free ingredients for your meals, but also fosters a deeper connection to the environment and a greater appreciation for the natural world. Start exploring your local green spaces and elevate your meals with nature's bounty. Parks, meadows and even urban areas can be home to a surprising variety of edible plants. Keep an eye out for familiar favorites like dandelions and nettles, but also be open to discovering new plants that you may not have noticed before. Each foraging trip is an opportunity to learn, discover and connect with nature in a meaningful way. If this video inspired you to try foraging, 
hit the like button, share your favorite wild plant in the comments below, and subscribe for more nature-based skills and delicious recipes. We'd love to hear about your foraging adventures and the creative ways you've incorporated wild plants into your meals. Your feedback and experiences help build a community of like-minded individuals who share a passion for sustainable living and a love for the natural world. Your journey to sustainable eating begins here. Embrace the adventure of foraging and discover the joy of harvesting your own food from the wild. Not only will you enjoy the freshest, most flavorful ingredients, but you'll also be contributing to a more sustainable and self-sufficient lifestyle. So grab a basket, head out into nature, and start your foraging journey today. The world of wild edibles is waiting for you to explore and enjoy.